All right, welcome back to more Skyward Sword. Last time we won the Wing Ceremony, and Zelda almost confessed something to us, and a giant tornado took her away, which kind of sucks. Yeah, that would freak me out if I saw that. Okay, I gotta run. Ugh, it's moving really fast. All right, I'm dashing. He doesn't run that fast indoors. When he's outside, he just takes off. Yeah, see, look what he's doing. Whoa! That kind of... Wait. I see what you're doing. It's the cat thing. And it's freaking crazy. Ow. Die, die, die. I just scared it. Oh, I don't care. I'm not falling for that crap. Yeah, apparently you can't kill these things. Anyway. Wait, what's this? Oh. Now I gotta get back up here. Anyway, apparently at night time, things go crazy, for some reason. I guess it's kind of like Pikmin. Ugh. Anyway, uh... Wow, I just wore myself out. I totally just lost my train of thought for some reason. Yeah, I was beating the crap out of that cat thing. And plus I was afraid I would jump into an endless abyss if I just ran forward like crazy. Interesting. Can I just flown here and call my bird or something like that? Would have made sense, but inside the statue of the goddess. That's not the master sword, I think. 
The one chosen by my creator. I have been waiting for you. You will play a role in the Great Destiny. According to your social custom, I should provide you with my personal designation. Phi is the name I was given. Is it Fee or Phi? I was created for a single purpose, long before the recorded memory of your people. I must aid you in fulfilling the great destiny that is your burden to carry. Come, Link, you must take up this sword as the chosen one, as the one chosen by my creator, it is your destiny. The strange tree is troubling your sleep. My sudden appearance. Uncertainty surrounding the fate of the one you hold dear. Under the circumstances, circumstances, it is only logical that you would exhibit some apprehension. A little bit, yeah. To minimize your uncertainty, uncertainty, allow me to share some information. My projections indicate that this information has a high probability of altering your current emotional state. Whoa, what did she just say? The way you think, seek Honorable Zelda is still alive. And this spirit maiden, the one you call Zelda, is another one cho is another chosen one fated to be a part of the same great mission. Therefore, should you wish to meet with your friend, I highly recommend you take up this sword before you set out to search for her. Does that information invigorate you? Are you ready to accept the sword? Might as well. It seems that further persuasive measures will not be required. What? What was she gonna do? In the name of my creator, draw the sword and raise it skyward. Ha! Ah, raise it skyward! Because it's called Skyward Sword, and it's a sword. Oh, okay. Interesting. Oh. That was kind of <laughs> weird. <laughs> I had to do it myself. The game won't let me be lazy. You got the goddess sword. This mysterious sword is bathed in divine light. Recognition complete. Master. Link. My master. Okay. Link. I've had my suspicions, but until now I wasn't sure. Yet here we are in the chamber of the s sword, the very place where it was foretold the youth of legend would one day appear. It is said that this place was left to our people by the goddess herself. The very knowledge of this room's existence is a secret passed down to a select few each generation, along with a handful of words. When the light of the goddess's sword shines bright, the great apocalypse will wake from its long slumber. Do not fear, for it is then that a youth, guided by my hand, shall reveal himself in a place most sacred. It started days ago. That sword I've kept secret all these years. It began to go a faint, otherworldly light. At first I was sure I was seeing things, here alone with the sword. There was simply no other explanation. I never dreamed the prophecy of legend would come to pass in my lifetime. The words I have sworn to keep secret are coming true before my very eyes. The youth will be guided by one born of the blade. One who is also youthful in likeness, yet wise with knowledge immeasurable. Ah, yes, the oral tradition. One of least reliable methods of information, retention, and transmission. What? It appears that critical sections of passage have been lost over the generations. The youth who draws forth the guiding sword shall be known as the goddess's chosen hero, and it is he who possesses an unbreakable spirit. He shall be burdened with the task of abolishing the shadow of Apocalypse from the land. Such is his destiny. 
With the spirit of the blade at his side, he shall soar over the clouds and plummet below. And united with the spirit maiden shall be bring forth a piercing light that resurrects the land. Some of Father's old texts talk about a place called the surface. Oh, she did say that. The old tales describe a whole world below, far more vast than the sky loft. Master, you must embark on a great journey beneath the clouds to the vast realm of the surface. It is only through this journey that you can fulfill the mission set before my creator, the goddess. It is also the only method available for you to reunite with the spirit maiden, Honorable Zelda. This is no easy task, Link. The world below is a forsaken place, and to reach it, you must pierce the cloud barrier below. In living memory, no one has ever done this. So as far as Zelda timelines go, I think this game would be considered first. Something like that. I don't know. This tablet with will illuminate a path through the clouds to the land below. Take it and place it within the altar behind me. You got the emerald tablet. The weathered surface of this heavy stone tablet feels very old. Master, the first thing you must do is hit the crest sitting in this room with a skyward strike. These splashes are form of pure energy that charges your blade when you lift it skyward. Once you have charged your blade, face the crest and swing your sword to send out a powerful skyward strike. I have to do things? Uh, I can't just press a button. Oh, um... Ah, okay. That's a Skyward Strike. Uh Okay. Oh, let me guess I gotta place these things together or something. Like a piece of a puzzle. Master Link, it is done. Until now, a cloud barrier created by the goddess has separated the world you know from the one below. The tablet you place on the altar has opened a small rift in the barrier. You can use it to travel through the clouds to the realm below. I recognize you as my master, and so it is my duty to follow you wherever you may go. I reside within your sword and will accompany you in your travels. Press down to summon me whenever you require my assistance. So it's like a robotic version of Midna. Link, listen a moment. The nature of the Great Apocalypse mission in the old text is a complete mystery to me. But whatever it turns out to be, it seems that both you and Zelda have big roles to play in the destiny of this land. Just think, if what Fee says is true, Zelda is alive. Alive and no doubt coming to terms with whatever it is the Goddess has in store for her. Should you heed the call of destiny, I don't know what dangers you may have to face, Link, especially down there. But if you decide to brave the unknown, please find my daughter and bring her back to me. What we've seen here today defies explanation, but it's only the start of your journey. Please see it through and prove the legend true. No, no way. Okay. You do your people proud, Link. <laughs> it's funny how they just give you an option. Well, I think. Even if he doesn't say, even if he says no, he'll still have to do it. Dawn is dawning. Oh, drawing near. <laughs> it has been a long night for both of us, hasn't it? You have a great journey before you, Link, and those clouds. Those clothes, they don't look up to the task. The uniform you were to receive for your winning race should be ready by now. A sturdy uniform like that will prove much more suitable for a long journey. You better change before you go.
everyone is certainly more expressive. Do I want to save my progress? Yes, I will. There we go. That other guy was wearing it. Was it Pea Pit? Except his was yellow. That green uniform is what our knights will be wearing this year. To be honest, I have my doubts about the color. But oddly enough, seeing you wear this uniform, I can't imagine a more fitting color for you. It's as if you were born to wear it. Ha ha ha. Take care on your journey and be sure to stop by some of the shops at the bazaar here in town to equip yourself properly for the travels ahead. I will return to my quarters and see if I can glean more useful information from the ancient texts. You are always welcome to stop by if you have questions. You and Zelda shall be in my prayers. May the goddess watch over you and guide you both. Link! Oh, it's you. That green uniform looks so adventurous. You sure like you sure look like a knight now. The headmaster said you're heading out to look for Zelda. You're really something else. I could never imagine myself doing what you're about to do. Yeah, the other world would be screwed. You got the adventure pouch. You can store all kinds of useful items in this handy piece of gear. Hmm. It's an adventure pouch. It's for adventures. It's neat because you can fit four things in it that you'll need on a big journey. You can buy all kinds of stuff at the bazaar. Okay, I should go look. Potions and a shield. Hint, hint. Of course I will. Who's else is gonna do it? Groose? Oh, it's one of his flunkies. I just saw the news. What? Because you don't look like a hero. I should punch you in the face. Where's Mr. Crybaby? That's Fledge. Who the hell are they? I'm gonna look through your. Whatever. I just did it. I just came in his room without permission. Poor Zelda. You, this is your fault, you know. You can barely fly straight, and yet somehow you beat me in the race. It should have been me up there with her that day, but I guess now I'll just have to be the one to save her. Yeah, good luck with that. Why don't you just, uh, just, uh, jump off? Wait. He has a picture of himself. And he has a picture of me on a punching bag. Really? Where's that picture of Zelda? Come on. Don't tell me. He has to have one. Maybe it's in here, I just couldn't see it. No, I mean, he's got to have a picture of Zelda in there somewhere. I know he does. Alright, uh... Uh. Creepy lady. Yep. I know I'll probably have to come back here. You always have to come back to your hometown at some point. Oh, I was looking at something. 
talk to this guy. I heard the news, Link. Zelda's fallen down to the clouds, and you're going to look for her? Is that right? Yeah, Master, tell me there's land beneath the clouds. Do you know anything about that? So that's the famous sword. Ah, but it won't do me much good if you don't have a shield to protect yourself with. Take this with you. Wind shield. Light wind shield breaks easily and can burn, so be careful how you use it. Light maneuver, but it's the weakest of all shields. Keep in mind. Yeah, I know that. Hold. Okay. I don't remember the sparring all is. Oh, I see. Might as well learn how to do some stuff. Yep, aren't we all? I wonder if I return the other one I took. Secrets of the fence. Okay. Okay. Practical stuff. Mm-hmm. Oh, this thing. Is this it? Protected myself. I'll try it. <laughs> that's a huge, that's a huge fail. I did it right. I have no idea. Oh, I, I already did this. I just wanted to practice. Alright, let's get out of here. I'll eventually get the shield thing right. I think I should go to the plaza. Oh. Master, I have an update regarding the stone tablet and the resulting column of light it created. It has appeared south of our location. Great opening and collaborators in land below. Seeing a surface armed with only a sore result. I've got a shield. Were you not paying attention? What? 
once you are accustomed to the controls, free to modify interface. Oh, I suppose I can. What's that mean? What is interf what does that mean? Pro Yeah, pro whatever, I'm sticking to this. Oh. I'm learning things. Anyway. I see that light now. Bye. It's Beatles Air Shop, it's here. What? I have I don't see it. Hmm. No, oh. <clears throat> I can't get it apparently. What? Each buildings can be found on small eyes floating around Skyloft. Here's my map. Alright, bizarre. Alright, I'm headed there. Ah, oh, it was closed off. I gotcha. What's this? What does my eyes behold? Whoa! I just now looked at his face. What the hell? Okay. I want to get away from him. He's really creeping me out. No. No, leave me alone. Please. Oh my god. Okay. Bombs. That's a shield. I need to find a potion. Yep. Next dash of pepper. Alright, she's cooking. I need a potion. Who's gonna give me one? Oh, I guess this potion lady. Uh, I guess I am a knight. I don't have a bottle. For some reason, I like you. Huh. <laughs> So 
what should a potion should I buy? Is there a baby in here? Oh, this video is like 30 minutes. I need to. I think I will buy that. Yeah, that's probably going to be it. I'm, like, pushing 30 minutes right now. So, all right, next time, we're going to go down to the surface.